r slash 2x chromosomes. Front unable says. Why is one woman never enough for man? 21. F asking question. I've broken up with my boyfriend because he watches porn, follows hot female girls and their content on Instagram. Trivial in this society I know. But not for me, he loved me so much, and I loved him more than I can express. I never had the desire to look at hot naked dudes, check other dudes out, or follow hot guys on Instagram. When I'm in love I only see this one person, yeah I do notice attractive people, but I don't actively look for them on the internet. It hurts me so much, this has really shattered my self esteem. Like, I'm hot, so many guys have told me, slim, the whole look etc. But still it's not enough. I'm never enough. We shared so many common interests, I supported him, loved him, had my own passions but still, he looks for. Girls with exactly the same interests as me on the internet, like playing guitar and these girls even have the same style as me. And it's only girls, like there are about 80% of guys doing the same content, about guitar and nerd stuff etc. But he only follows hot girls obviously. He even jerked off to them. Wow, that must be love. I've given up, he did everything for me, he loved me so much, and even for him, I was not enough. He has to look at other girls that are like me. But why is just me not enough? I've given up on dating, I hate it. Why even bother loving someone, if they like staring at hot naked girls anyway? And I know every guy does this, so it won't get better than this. I thought he only saw me, how naive. Bark said cat and ween says. They are junkies and they won't admit it. Much like tobacco and alcohol and high tension power lines and everything else women report as harmful and literally cancer, men making money don't give a shit. Inaquiveritus says. I know you're hurting right now, but it's for the best. You are best rid of him. No guy is worth your self esteem. No guy is worth you waiting around while he pursues, engages with and jerks off to other women. Men have somehow gaslighted society into thinking it's normal, because the sex industry is a very lucrative business that overwhelmingly benefits them, and you're the problem. It's really not the case. Most men will try to convince you it's normal, because it benefits them. For me it's a huge turn off too, I wouldn't question them, I would just leave them to it and walk away. Keep your standards, you are enough. Hugs X. Since the referred says. Because his porn has become an addiction. Addicts can love people, but they love their addiction more. Resurrect underscore John underscore Brown says. IDK, I have an unconventional opinion about this topic. I guess it basically boils down to a, uh, the whole thing about men, having super high sex drives is a myth, and there is research for this part, and b, men do a lot of performing to get the approval of other men. In fact, I think this is true about a whole lot of things regarding traditional masculinity. It's a performance for other men and actually has very little to do with women at all, aside from using them as props. A multical orpany says. I'm so sorry you are experiencing this, and I know how painful it is. I wish I had an answer to give you, but it's a question that I have mostly been unable to answer for myself too. At least when it comes to the extent to which men are unwilling or incapable of not watching porn and will choose it over relationships, marriages, work, family it is beyond comprehension. It's something about their brain's reward circuit for dopamine patriarchal conditioning and misogyny, and probably some differences in biology, and who knows what else. You are enough. I'm enough. It's not about us, it's about them. It's their problem to live with, not ours. There's more to experience in life, than being in a relationship with someone who can't or won't respect you and your feelings. While you are out experiencing the real world, and forming real connections with others, men can waste their lives living in their own perfect and fake fantasy land, and being lonely with only their own dick to hold in their hand. They will never be satisfied, and constantly chasing something fake, but you can find your own satisfaction in life. 
Legidus says. Hugs through the internet. Sika 4 says. I feel like I'm going through a similar experience. It's so shitty and I'm sorry. Navitas says. Honestly, I think no one could fulfill all, or rather fit perfectly to someone else's needs, and hope you can distance yours from another's. Maybe the following can provide you a perspective. Simply put, people are different. What is enough for you is not necessarily enough for someone else. What is too much for you isn't for another. Maybe you are full after a salad, another person is much hungrier, and eats three bowls of spaghetti. Would you expect the other person, to be satisfied after the salad because you are? Maybe you, want to and need to, run 5 miles every day, that would be too much for me. Personally for many activities and choices in lifestyle, including those in the bedroom, I have goals, needs, wants, expectations. When I go to a sports club, I want to progress steadily, focused and fast. If it is a partner sport, EX. Competitive dancing, and my dancing. Partner does not share a similar drive, talent, time management. And could not keep up, I would be very frustrated after a while. Yes, that is my problem, coming from my upbringing, and I'm getting help to work on it, but on the other hand I'd never expect another person, to match my goals in multiple domains. So it's appropriate for me to have a dedicated partner for dancing. This all can only work, if the people are really aware, of what they want in a sense of accepting one's own, sometimes frightening shortcomings and then, if they feel secure enough to face the consequences, and are able to communicate it. All of this has nothing to do with how much I love my partner. And of course I want my partner's needs met as well. Dear Open Community, what do you think about that? Besides having a controversial opinion on this, I wish you the Bark Sengin says. Being attracted to other women doesn't mean he doesn't love you. Sex and love can be independent for many people. Loads of women still like checking out hot guys while in relationships, and plenty of men only focus on one woman. It's all about meeting someone compatible. Dead for Cereals says. It sucks and makes me wanna kill myself. Makata Disco says. There are an enormous number of men, and women, who are polyamorous. Just like sexual orientation exists on a spectrum, numerical orientation exists on a spectrum. I'm very old now, like that age, where I wake up, text my, grown up, children, read the paper, and have nothing else to do, but stare at my portfolio the rest of the day, I've even calculated how much I make per year, but down to the hour and minute. Yes, my life is very boring now, and I've got nothing left to do, but reminisce about my past, but I make sure to be honest with myself. What's the point, if at my age, there certainly will be no more romantic interests, I can't at least lay all the cards out on the table, and be honest with myself. I'll tell you what gave me the most meaning in life. I mean the deepest deepest feelings of satisfaction, the most pleasant thoughts, that would swirl around in my head for years on end. Growth, like economic growth, growth in knowledge and learning, growth in skills, building my first house, my first garden. r slash 2x chromosomes. HW underscore Jina says. Why am I suddenly getting followed by only fans bots? I wasn't sure where to post this, I thought some people here might be able to help. I've been on reddit for about a year and a half now, and never had this before. For the last couple of weeks I've had about 20 accounts from OnlyFans people adding me. They appear to be bots, because their bias are almost identical and none of them have any content. I block each of them, but they keep coming. I've had 3 new follows today. Why has this started happening? And how do I stop it? Has someone entered my account name onto a subscribers list or something? Most of them are incognito so, if I don't immediately block them, I can't see their name in my followers list, it just gives me a number of followers. 
I found some Google instructions to unallow followers, which apparently kicks everyone off, and then re-allowed it, and the list has gradually filled up again. Asphalt Advertex X says. I disable following on my account. I do not see a good purpose for this to even exist, this is not Twitter. Spiralfet says. Yup. I disabled them, and now I no longer wonder why me. 308 says. Seems there's a bot wave going around Reddit RN, because I've heard people mentioning this in all types of subs. Disinfect Puntis says. That's normal on Reddit now somehow. Just remove slash block them, and be done with it. They need the money. Charming Charge 596 says. Same here, I had about 10 in the past week. Seems to have stopped now. M to Hellebore says. It is not just you. Apparently Reddit is aware of the issue. But as to a solution? IDK. It appears that most of the follows I have received are from accounts that no longer exist, so they might be getting banned. Golden underscore Mandela says. Me too. I have started ignoring them all, but it is definitely strange and annoying. Practical Conflict 737 says. There are followers on Reddit. Black13 says. Is that what those are? I've never cared enough to check. You're following my boring ass. Okay, you do your thing. Comery underscore K says. In the 6 years of having this account I've had more bot follows in the last 2 weeks than ever before as well. Panacrazy says. Oh my god I thought it was just me, I thought someone from a previous flame war got mad and started spamming me. Barberidal says. I've been getting on Liffin's followers lately as well. A couple more just today. Lil underscore Rady K underscore Bird says. I think I read in the technology subreddit about the upcoming blackout that porn subs have been starting to be banned due to the upcoming IPO. The abusers have nowhere to go and have been spamming users who allow followers. I suggest turning off the follow option. It seemed creepy from the start when you weren't able to turn it off or remove spam followers. Old Fox 3027 says, "This happens to everyone." Astrop Astrogeneral says. So how do you stop people following? My laptop died, and I only have a phone. Moopig48 says. Driving me bonkers. I block them. So annoying. Ashley Emerald says. I have also recently started having this issue. Vinjuice says. I deck why, I literally don't even look at porn so why tf do they keep showing up? Anna underscore, V says. I have had this happen too. I just ignore them, not like they actually follow me. I don't really even know why they would do that. Like, as an advertisement, one post anywhere on Reddit would reach a bazillion people more than following some random person. It's not like followers get anything on Reddit. I don't understand why they do this, but I don't really care. It's not like they affect anything in my Reddit experience. Niacy180 says. Same has been happening to me, seems they come from comments in popular subreddits. Scoobidoom2 says. Presumably something put you on a list as someone who might be interested. My best guess would be subscribing or participating in a male-dominated subreddit. Jawwin says. Holy shit, yes. It's so bad lately. Apogee of the Dark Hold says. I finally figured out how to turn it off. Annoying. I don't want real people following me, let alone fake ones. On a teaspoon salt says. What's the point? I see on Liffin's links in the bias when I bother to check, although I mostly ignore them altogether, but I just don't. Click the link, lol. What benefit is there to following me? Tanted but whole says. Yep same thing is happening to me. Kitakatakata says. 
they get banned fast, but Reddit doesn't mind throwing their OnlyFans biopics on my Android notifications. Porn Star Virgin says. Same, I have a large following but all of a sudden it's 5 plus porn accounts a day following. Hardcore Eshadow says. This has been happening to me recently as well, looks like it's a common issue at the moment then. Stupid says. Me too. That's all for this video thank you for watching please subscribe.